Changes are on the way to Highway 32 in Chico as a multi-year Caltrans project was approved this week. Now improvements will be made along the Highway 99 connection to Muir Avenue. And new tonight, Action News Now reporter Ryan Ketchum spoke with people who travel that stretch of road to see how this will affect them. Fixing the sidewalk, water drains, and lighting are among the issues this project will be focusing on. One business owner tells me the lack of lighting has been a problem. At night, I work late sometimes, and there's no lighting here. So when I'm pulling out, I got to make sure that I'm not going to hit any pedestrians walking on the sidewalks. This is the view of Highway 32 from the front of Full Attack Motorsports near the on-ramp of Highway 99 off of East 9th Street. As you can see, it gets very dark in this area. Many tell me they hope they'll see that change. There's going to be lights for the pedestrians and for me personally and my customers to pull out when it's dark. And I really would like to see people paying attention more when they drive on this road. As you can see behind me, Highway 32 is a speed limit of 35 miles per hour. But several people tell me they see too many accidents and fast driving. Many say with the driving and no sidewalks or broken up sidewalks in many areas makes them feel unsafe. I honestly don't know if I would feel comfortable just knowing too like there's a lot of student drivers in Chico and like that and it's just knowing that in itself is is kind of scary just because like the less experience and I feel like the more safety precautions like put in the better just because of that too. Several people living in the area tell me they're just glad to see something being done about these issues. Uh, I think it's good for the community to, to keep maintaining and keep up on top of things. Caltrans PIO Gilbert Motes Chan tells me they've been given $3.51 million to complete the design for this project. Construction is expected to begin in fall of 2023 and expected to be completed by the end of 2025. Reporting in Chico, I'm Ryan Ketchum. Action News Now, coverage you can count on. Well, this project is part of a 10-year transportation system improving plan, improvement plan that California is investing nearly $590 million toward.